Spike Lee's Black Klansman gets a release date. The famous filmmaker's latest effort, which stars John David Washington, Adam Driver, and Laura Harrier, will open on August 10th to coincide with the one-year anniversary of the Charlottesville riots. The movie tells the real-life story of Ron Stallworth, an African-American police officer from Colorado who was able to infiltrate a local chapter of the Ku Klux Klan. It's Spike Lee's first film in three years since Chirac opened in 2015 to mixed reviews. John Krasinski's tense horror thriller, A Quiet Place, topped the box office last weekend with an unexpected $50 million, knocking off Ready Player One and outperforming the comedy, Blockers, which came in third. Estimates had A Quiet Place landing at about 30 to 34 million, and the success of the film has already gotten Hollywood talking about a sequel. Co-screenwriters Brian Woods and Scott Beck stated as much. In an interview with Fandango this past week, they said, quote, It's such a fun world. There are so many things you can do. There are certainly so many stories you can tell. Hollywood is also buzzing about two HBO films that debuted this past week. Paterno, starring Al Pacino, and Andre the Giant about the late legendary wrestler. Many are saying that Pacino should earn his fourth Primetime Emmy Award for his portrayal as disgraced Penn State football coach Joe Paterno. He's won twice in the past for Angels in America and You Don't Know Jack, and was nominated in 2013 for his portrayal of record mogul Phil Spector. Both Paterno and Andre the Giant are available on HBO Now and HBO Go. And that's what's hot in Hollywood.